In Manila, in the Philippines, there are flourishing Buddhist activities in the Kaju Center, which was originally initiated by the 16th Kamapa. In 2006, the 17th Kamapa visited the Philippines for the first time. Posters of the Kamapa were to be seen all over Manila. He was given a fine reception. We say our very warm welcome, Mabuhay. And I take this opportunity to give to His Holiness the key to the city of Manila, the symbol of each and every Manileño's warm welcome and appreciation. Thank you for your warm reception this afternoon. Various figures from public life came to see the Kamapa personally. The public events were attended by thousands of people. The members of the Karma Kaju Center were also able to meet the Karmapa in a more private atmosphere. The Karmapa was also invited to visit the General Hospital in Manila. He blessed many of the patients and gave small presents to the children. The best cure that you can give yourself is your will to survive. There's always a chance. The Kamapa visited the cancer ward too and found words of consolation as he tended to the patients. About 600 students registered for a lecture which the Kamapa gave at the University of Manila. There is a reason that we can go on, that there's a reason why we have to put effort and make this existence a useful one. Prior to his departure, the Kamapa expressed his thanks to the organizers of his first stay in Manila. The policemen who escorted the Kamapa on their motorcycles had also grown very fond of him. With flowing white scarves, which the Kamapa had given to them when saying goodbye, they accompanied him to the airport. <laughs> 